Hi guys, welcome to our channel Tech Traps. We present to you what's new, what matters and how technology can enrich your life. I am your host Suhani Khanna. So without further ado, let's get this video started. NASA has developed a method of verifying the identity of a person based on his or her heartbeat, electrocardiogram signal. The technique uses an algorithm that has been shown to be more reliable than other current procedures, such as fingerprint verification, retina verification, or detecting biometric identifiers from heart signals. You must be wondering what biometrics is in a layman's world. Let me explain. Biometrics refers to the measurement and analysis of unique or physical behavioral characteristics of individuals for the purpose of identification and authentication or access control. These characteristics are distinct to each person and are difficult to replicate or forge, making biometrics an effective method for verifying identity. There are two main categories of biometric characteristics. Firstly, we have physiological biometrics. These are physical traits that are unique to each individual. Examples include fingerprint patterns, facial features, etc. Secondly, we have behavioral biometrics. These are traits related to an individual's behavior or actions. Examples include voice patterns, typing rhythm, etc. Biometric system capture these characteristics through specialized sensor or devices such as fingerprint scanners, facial recognition cameras, or voice recognition software. Biometrics offer several advantages including increased security, convenience, and efficiency compared to traditional authentication methods like passwords or pins. However, there are also privacy and security concerns associated with the collection and storage of biometric data, which must be addressed to ensure the ethical and responsible use of biometric technology. When it comes to NASA, advancing methods and devices for biometrics, it has employed various biometric methods for different purposes, particularly in the realm of space exploration and research. But biometric methods are utilized to ensure the safety, security and health of astronauts, as well as to facilitate efficient operation of spacecrafts and equipments. Some of the basic methods adopted by NASA are fingerprint recognition, Fingerprint recognition is commonly used by NASA for access control and identity verification purposes. Biometric scanners equipped with fingerprint recognition technology are used to grant access to restricted areas within spacecraft, research facilities and other NASA installations. Secondly, we have facial recognition. Facial recognition technology is employed by NASA for identifying and verifying individuals' identity. This technology may be used in conjunction with other security measures to control access to sensitive areas and ensure the safety of astronauts and personnel. Thirdly, we have retinal scanning. Retinal scanning involves capturing an image of the blood vessel patterns at the back of the eye, which is unique to each individual. NASA may utilize retinal scanning technology for authentication purposes, particularly in scenarios where high levels of security are required. Fourthly, we have voice recognition. Voice recognition technology may be utilized by NASA to identify individuals based on their unique vocal characteristics. This biometric method can be employed for authentication purposes and may also be integrated into spacecraft control systems to enable voice command functionalities. Fifthly, we have biometric monitoring. In addition to identify verification, NASA employs biometric methods for monitoring the health and well-being of astronauts during space missions. Biometric sensors are used to collect data on vital signs such as heart rate, blood pressure, oxygen saturation and body temperature, enabling real-time monitoring of astronauts' physiological states. Sixthly, we have behavioral biometrics. NASA may also utilize behavioral biometrics, which involves analyzing the patterns of behavior such as typing dynamics, gait analysis and other unique behavioral traits for authentication and identification purposes. These biometric technologies play a crucial role in enabling the successful execution of NASA's exploration and research objectives in space. But these are very common to mostly every asset intensive and tech industry. What is something that NASA is offering to advance distinguish in its security? The new tech introduced to biometrics by NASA is cardiac biometrics. The advantage of using cardiac biometrics over existing methods is that 
hard signatures are more difficult to force compared to any other biometric devices like iris scanners can be fooled by contact lenses and sunglasses and a segment of the population does not have a readable fingerprint due to the age or working conditions Previous electrocardiographic signals employed a single template and compared that template with the new test templates by the means of cross correlation or linear discriminant analysis. The benefit of this technology over competing cardiac biometric methods is that it is more reliable that a significant reduction in error rates. The benefit of this technology is that it creates a probabilistic model of the electrocardiographic features of a person instead of a single signal template of the average heartbeat. The probabilistic model described a Gaussian mixture model allows various modes of the feature distribution in contrast to a template model that only characterizes a mean waveform. Another advantage in that model uses both physiological and anatomical characterization of the heart. Unlike other methods that mainly use only physiological characterization of the heart. By combining features from different leads, the heart of a person is better characterized in terms of anatomical orientation because each lead represents a different projection of the electoral vector of the heart. Thus, employing multiple electrocardiographic leads provides a better performance in subject verification or identification. Overall, NASA employs a range of biometric methods to ensure the security and safety, well-being of astronauts as well as to enhance the efficiency and effectiveness of space missions and operations. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and share. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel Tech Traps. Stay tuned for many more tech savvy videos on many more technological topics. Signing off, Suhani Khanna.